welcome to this video. I'm Ashlyn and this is my, you're seven now, right? Yeah. Seven year old cousin Elise. And today we're gonna be making bath bombs and talking about life. The first part we have to do is pretty simple. And then we have to let it sit for an hour. But this is gonna be like the outside of our bathroom because we're gonna do like geodes. We're gonna be fancy. We're gonna be fancy like that. Okay, so. Combine a fourth a cup of Epsom salt, which is there. Can you open that for me, dear? Citric acid, cornstarch, and baking soda. What's next? Ow. Did you just kick me? Did you just kick me? Add what to to put uh add one and a half tablespoons of melted coconut oil, drops of essential oil, and half tablespoon of water. Okay, this is our I'll go get some oh, no. water. Get yeah, do you wanna go get our tablespoon of water? Perfect. Oh it's a fizzin. Is that intentional? Easy. Should we have done that? Was this a bad idea? No, I think that was I feel like I should have added the coconut oil beforehand. Oops. One and a half tablespoons. Yeah, it's slowing it down a little bit. This is fine. This is fine! <laughs> I really don't want to mix this with my hands. Why don't you mix it with your hands? I feel like you're more resilient than I am. You mix a fourth cup Epsom salt, a fourth cup citric acid, a fourth cup cornstarch, and a fourth cup baking soda with a tablespoon of water and a tablespoon and a half of coconut oil. Mix it well. And, and mix it well. <laughs> and then take a little and put it into your container. Pack it into your molds and then theoretically leave it to dry for an hour and this will make it look better than it does now because it's, it's a bit of a hot mess, but okay. So far, this is what we got. It's a little bit jerky and not exactly what you would expect out of geodes, but you know what? We're gonna go with it. So we will see you in an hour. And that was the cool part. <laughs> Hi, again. We're working on our bath bombs. And they sat for an hour, not quite an hour, but we're gonna start mixing up the other stuff and then add it. Put a fourth of a cup in each bowl. Do you think you're pretty smart? Are you a smart person? I guess. You guess? Mm -hmm. Do you think you're smarter than me? No. Well, all right, That's, that helps my ego. Do you think you're smarter than high schoolers? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. Is what this calls for is you take literally just your Epsom salt and you put a lot of it into one, make it really dark. You put like half of that into the other to make it not so dark. And you just put a little bit into the last one to make it not very dark at all. All right, we have brownies now. I'm not gonna try to make those because they're Walmart brownies. They're very, very simple. So we got our dark, medium, light. Yeah. This is our dark. This is our light. And that's not our light, that's medium. 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 And this is our very, very light. You just put all the lightest stuff. And you put it around the outside. And then we go through and we add our darker stuff in the middle, or medium in the middle. And then, finally, the dark. The obvious transition, we use the dark and we put a little bit in the very center. And you drizzle half a tablespoon of coconut oil over the top of all of these. You let it harden for you a few hours. It just pretty much is for some time. And then you pack for it. For some after. time. But to make it hard faster, you can put it in the freezer or refrigerator. And you are done.